Ah, so you finally awoken. Where are we? Ah, in my super secret lair, of course. Wait, so are you saying you drugged and kidnapped us? Yeah, and uh, stuffed us in full plate armor. Where did you even get these? You didn't steal them, did you? Um, I plead the fifth, but don't worry, it was all for a good cause. What in the world could possibly warrant kidnapping? I have a feeling it wasn't just to dress up as a crusader or something, was it? No, not merely to dress the part, but to fully commit to it. You don't mean, yes, we are going on our own crusade! You're joking, right? There's, there's no way you can be serious. Yeah, this is a small gang at most, not a full-blown legion. Like, do we even have any ranks? Yes, I'm the general. You are a foot soldier, and you can be the squat. Uh, can I get a different role? Silent, squire. You will only speak when spoken to. I never agreed to this. Shut up! Slowly, peasant, you are in the presence of the greatest general that ever lived. <sighs> now then, back to the point. The target of our crusade is this harbor town not too far away from here. Uh, dude, that's our college campus. Not anymore. It is true that this place was once where we had trained our minds for the psychological torment of a regular 9-to-5 job. However, they have committed one sin which is absolutely inexcusable which is that they have replaced the chicken nuggets with veggie meat R really it is inexcusable all those children living under the oppression of the board of education they will suffer no longer the yoke of this heresy oh uh, okay so what's the plan that my dear underling is very simple once we commandeer a vessel, we will land at the front harbor and start stabbing all the armed soldiers in the area. Do you, do you not understand how that will never work? Ever? Of course it will work. They expect a sneak attack or a surprise raid. So if we show up at the front gate and announce our presence, they'll be caught off guard. Truly, I'm a master of strategy. No, you're not. And I say we call off this misadventure before anyone gets hurt. Are you conspiring with the enemy, you heretic? Uh, no, but... Ah, then. You must agree with me. <sighs> now, you must leave soon. Else nightfall before we arrive. Which is when we should be attacking... You dare question me, mortal! Nope, you lead the way, your bipolarness. What about you, squire? Do you dare question my genius as well? Ah, uh, good. Then we depart immediately. Hi, I'm your Uber driver. Excuse me, but how much for one ride to that barbarian settlement over yonder? Uh, five shillings. Five? But it's not even that far away. Make it four. Uh, we're giving a discount to the mentally handicapped today. Uh, normally it would be six. Six? But that ship looks so unseaworthy, I don't think it would even make it out of the bay. Make it three. Five. Take it or leave it. This is extortion, I tell you. I accept, but mark my words. Once I finish my current crusade, you're next. Now, Squire, if you would please hold my sword and wait for my return. No, it's hot out here, and I'm not your squire. Silence, slave! Now obey your glorious general. Wait, you're coming unarmed? Yes, I intend to beat my enemies into submission. I have decided to go easy on them. You do know you can't beat a bunch of armed soldiers with just your fist, right? Not unless your muscles are as large as mine. Oh. Uh. I despise you. Ooh, I know. Since you're so muscular, why don't you go take them on your own? Besides, if I go, then who will carry my sword? Huh. You're right. I am amazing. Besides, it's not like I want any of the glory to go to you, whelps. Yeah, wouldn't want that. 
Alright, it's settled. I'm going alone. Um, yeah, go get him, General. Well, thank goodness that's over. Yeah, there's no way I was gonna sit here in the sun all day wearing this hot metal. By the way, do you think he'll be alright? Ah, uh, nah, he's gonna die. Yeah, probably. So, do you want to get a drink somewhere? Sure, if you're by. Frickin' cheapskate. Fine, whatever. Captain. Yeah, what is it? We have an unscheduled ship arriving from the bay. So, what? We've caught a glimpse of a wanted fugitive on that ship. Oh. Well, what did he do? Sir, this man is wanted for multiple cases of kidnapping, drugging, raiding the armory on many occasions, and... And what? It says, and I quote, challenging multiple officials of the law to a duel with his bare fists, losing horribly, and then accusing any interfering guards of cowardice. Well, how much is the bounty? Uh, twelve shillings and a free pen, sire. Eh, it's not worth capturing him then. So, you're letting him go? No, oh, too much paperwork. No, oh, instead, blast him. Are we there yet? No. Are we there yet now? No. Are we there yet now? No! I must say your customer service is terrible. Oh my finger. If you don't if we don't arrive soon, I swear I'm gonna have to take my money back. That's that's not how it works. Well, this freight will never get there. That attitude. What was that? Never mind. Ready men? Fire at will. Fire at will. Oh, you suck at this. Oh. Well, I would say we got him, boys. No. Captain, you must not die. You still have a voyage to complete. And I have a crusade to finish. But more importantly than all that, you still owe me money. No, I don't owe you anything. Yes, you do. You owe me five silver coins, both in my emotional damages, as well as for ripping me off on this crap V vessel. I don't owe you, Jack. <sighs> oh no. Curse you, cowardly scum! The end. Well, what did you think? It was absolutely awful.